Hello, this is Carolyn. Welcome to my channel, Carolyn or Clothes. Today I am, first of all, I want to say thank you for all returning subscribers. I really appreciate uh, you coming back to my channel, supporting my channel. It helps me in the YouTube rankings so that I get elevated in recommendations and more people can then see my channel and, and view my uh, videos. And eventually, if I get enough of an audience, uh, I get subsidized by uh, YouTube. So please, um, if you haven't already, subscribe. Uh, if you have subscribed, thank you very much. Um, and I also was hoping maybe I can use this little thing to get you to subscribe is my daughter, who is 16 years old, is a little bit on the snarky side and says, nobody is gonna subscribe to you, mom. So I kind of was hoping some of you who have been watching my videos would like to prove her wrong and subscribe and then help me out. Okay, so today I am going to give you a Stitch Fix um, review and try on. I got three things from Stitch Fix Shop Your Looks. Okay, the very first thing I got is a 41 Hawthorne, which is a name brand exclusive to Stitch Fix. I haven't yet figured out who makes 41 Hawthorne, so if anybody knows who makes 41 Hawthorne, um, let me know, but it's exclusive to Stitch Fix. It's the Jacinda Twist Neckline Knit Top in magenta, and it's a size extra small. Now, when I saw it online, I kind of figured it was kind of like something you would wear under a blazer um, or, or cardigan for the office, which is good. The material is 95% polyester, 5% spandex. As you can see, it's, it's nice and stretchy. Um, it's machine washed, tumble dry, and it was $44. My, I liked it when I saw it on my shop, my looks. I thought it was kind of unique that it had this twist neckline. I thought that was kind of cute. I kind of liked that. Um, I like the color, um, and I really like that aspect of it. My first impressions when I received it is this is an extra small, and I honestly think this is quite large for an extra small. So I will uh, have to see when I try it on. I'm hoping it, it fits okay. It might be a little bit big, but I think it's gonna lay close to the body based on the fabric. So I think I might be okay with it. The armholes do not look too big. I'm hoping they're okay, but I'll try them on and let you know. The next item I got was also 41 Hawthorne. It's not very exciting but I thought the price was right, and it looked like a good basic I can have. It's the Benny Wrap Front Ruched Knit Navy Top, and this one is an extra small petite, all right? Interesting that these are both considered knit tops, but the texture is very different, and the reason why the fabric content is different, whereas this one was 95% polyester, this one is 48% rayon, 48% polyester, and 4% spandex. And it has more, because it has a rayon in it, it has more of a rayon or cottonish type of feel to it. This is wash, machine wash, and then lay flat to dry, and it was only $38. So I thought with the price for $38, I thought it was really good. And I think I've seen this on other people on YouTube model this top, and it looked nice on them. So I thought I'd give it a shot. My first impressions when I got it, I liked it, but this is a really open and deep V. Um, and I wasn't planning on wearing a cami underneath this. It's not something I really wanted to wear during the summer's two layers. I will have to see how it is when it's on, so we'll see. The last top I got is a Fortune and Ivy. I don't know, I don't think this is a Stitch Fix name brand, but I might be wrong. Um, it's called the Marciana Lattice Back Detail Knit Top, and it's in light pink, and it's, um, like a heathered with black. So when I saw it online, I really liked the back of it. I really liked the detail of the back. I really liked the banded bottom. I think it brings me in a waist. I really liked the ruched um, sleeves. So when I saw it online, I liked it a lot. And I said, this, a knit top, this would be perfect for working from home and being, you know, nice and cozy and comfy or casual weekends. Um, you know, I'm thinking knit top. I was thinking more like a cottonish type of knit or even a cotton poly blend 
This ends up being 95% polyester, 5% spandex. It feels like a thick athletic shirt, almost like a scuba shirt. It's very stretchy and slinky and not what I had in mind at all. So um, it's got look dynamite on, but I think for sure I'm gonna be returning this. I mean, I can't imagine me liking it once it's on. But I'll try it on and um, we'll see how everything goes. Okay, give me a few minutes and I'll be right back. The first top I have on is the Jacinza uh, top in magenta in a size extra small. Um, I thought it was going to be too big, but it obviously is not. It actually fits quite well. I really like this top and I think I'm going to keep it. The, I paired it with um, a pair of light gray um, pants I from, I believe it was a Calvin Klein outlet like a couple years ago and a pair of gray shoes. I believe they're um, Alfani from Macy's. So I'm pretty happy with this top. This is the, the back of it has the key, keyhole closure. The front has the, the cutouts right here. I probably wear it with a cardigan or jacket, possibly in the office. I'm not quite sure yet. Um, I can wear this with black. I can wear this with beige. I can wear it with uh, white, um, pretty much anything, navy. So I, I like this top. I think it's a very, um, pretty much a staple. I mean, it's a bright color, but pretty much a staple. And I think I can wear it in the winter as well. All right, next up. Next up is the uh, Benny Rat top. This one was also by 41 Hawthorne. Um, this is a shocker from what I took it out of the box. When I saw it out of the box and saw how it was wrapped and loose and open, I thought for sure I'd have to wear a cami under it. But as other YouTubers demonstrated, this one fits very nicely and it's a very reasonable price. And the quality um, seems quite good too. I mean, it seems like a good fabric. It's, uh, I really like this top and I think it goes very well. Um, I've just kept the same pants on, but obviously it's, it's a navy top and it's pretty simple and basic, but it fits very nicely. So I am very pleasantly surprised by this and I'm keeping this. I believe this was $36. All right, and last up is the top that I'm pretty sure I am returning. Last top. This is the Fortune and Ivy Marciana Knit Top. It's the lattice back detail, which originally attracted me to it. Plus, the, I, like, I like banded bottoms because they tend to give me a waist. I like details like ruching. I thought this was a cute top. I hate it. <laughs> uh, it feels to me like a thick workout shirt. Almost not quite as thick as like scuba, but it is very slinky, non-breathable, not soft and cozy like I was expecting it to be. Um, and as far as fit, it's really nothing special. It's nothing I would want to spend my money on. So this one is going back. Well, that is a wrap up for today. I hope you enjoyed shop um, your looks from Stitch Fix and let me know what you liked, what you didn't like. And if you haven't already, please, please, please subscribe and like my video. I really appreciate uh, any support that you can give. Thank you.